Hi, my name is Dr. Larry Gilman. I'm one of the co-directors of bariatric surgery at North Shore University Hospital. Uh, we've been doing bariatric surgery here for the past uh, uh, almost 15 years. And uh, I'm going to be talking today about uh, a patient's guide through this journey of bariatric surgery. Many people are coming to uh, consider bariatric surgery to help the significant epidemic of morbid obesity in the United States. So let me start by just telling you that uh, when you're considering having bariatric surgery, there are different procedures that you would be considering. Each procedure has certain risks and benefits associated with them. And it's very important to talk to your surgeon regarding these uh, different procedures and which procedure may be right for you. Understand that these different types of procedures that are out there may be beneficial to certain individuals and different types of procedures would be beneficial for other types of individuals. The first thing you need to know is that it's very important that you go to a place called, that, ha, that it's a center of excellence. A center of excellence is a uh, distinction that is given to certain programs uh, that is given by the ASMBS. The ASMBS is the governing body for bariatric surgery, not only in the United States, but in Europe. Within that uh, center of excellence, it's important to get a, 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 the workup prior to any procedure. Surgery for bariatric, sur for bariatric uh, procedures are uh, not like any other procedure in the sense that there are specific workups that may be different than you might expect if you were going in for a groin hernia or any other type of a general surgical procedure. This workup has been uh, uh, standardized throughout the country and involve uh, evaluation of not only your physiologic state, uh, your heart, your lungs, whether you have sleep apnea, but also psychological evaluation uh, as well as a nutritional evaluation prior to any procedure. So before you decide on any kind of a uh, procedure, Make sure that that program that you go to uh, uh, follows the rules uh, that the ASMBS has put out regarding the workup of any patient prior to uh, undergoing bariatric surgery. 